In this video, I'd like us to look at some configurable attributes to transitions in Camtasia 2022. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Now, in the latest version of Camtasia for Windows 2022.3, it's possible to change some few attributes of transitions. So what we're going to begin with is just, uh, just highlight some of my media here and then add it to the timeline right here. So uh, we can actually just drag and drop the media right here. Here we go. Maybe we can add, okay, we can add this one as well. Maybe this one uh, and maybe this one. Now we have uh, some four clips right inside here. To our transitions, let's go to the transitions. And there are a bunch of transitions right inside here. But let's say we begin with the first one and add it maybe somewhere there. If I play this video, that is how it transitions. If I zoom in slightly and click on the transition, from the properties pane, you see that you can change uh, the type uh, of an, uh, transition. This is always available. You can also use streamed content. You can reverse. You can change the count. For example, let's hover over this. And then let's say we change the count to be lower, to be higher. It's the way you want it to be. Really, really awesome. You can also randomize the way those uh, mosaic kind of uh, things are set. You can also bring it back slightly or somewhere there. So now if we actually play it, there we go. Let's say we want to reverse this and see how it looks like. So that is what it looks like. But simply put, you can actually configure some transitions. Uh, let's say we go to something like a uh, solid arrows. We drag and drop this here. And uh, when we look at this, that's what they look like. Some green arrows passing by. If I click on this, we can go right here and change some few attributes. We can change the color. For example, uh, maybe you want, or your branding has this type of color, click on that. And then if we play, that's what it looks like. You can also do something else. You can flip horizontally so that it's from now, from uh, kind of like right, right uh, to the left side. There we go, right to left. You can also do a reverse, whereby it goes from left to right, moving backward. So it's really awesome that we can configure some attributes of uh, these uh, elements and transitions. Uh, and we can also add maybe something else here. Maybe something like a blob, uh, drag and drop it here. And then let's see, uh, we have the count, you can change the count. Uh, let's say we go with that. And then if you play your video right there, there we go. And these are extremely good additions to Camtasia in that if you're creating slideshow videos using Camtasia, especially photo slideshows, even video slideshows, this will come in handy to create a more professional look than just the standard fades uh, and so on and so forth. So uh, that is something I recommend you check out uh, the new customizable options uh, for the transitions in Camtasia 2022. I hope this video has been of value to you.